Hey guys, what's up? Today, um, I'm going to show you guys another trick, and I uh, hope you guys like it. And yeah, so, we're going to start out, but start out, yeah, by using the deck of shovel, just like that. And now, let's, um, let's go ahead and take out all the hearts in the deck, just, just because. So, let's see. Um, let's get all these hearts out here. And a nine, and a four, and a three, and a seven, and uh, okay. Wait, is that all? Um, yeah. All right. Wait. About that. Okay. All right. So that's. I think this is all the, all the hearts in the deck. Uh, let me just count. Let's see that one. Two, three, four, five, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. Yeah. All right. So these are all the hearts in the deck, and you can see they're in a pretty random order. We got. Uh, the king over here, and ace over here, all over the place. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to actually um, get this in numeric order from ace to king, or king to ace, whatever, um, without looking at the cards. So, um, yeah, I think I think I can do this. So let me, let me see. Um, let's see. Let's see, let's do that. 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 That that and let's see what else um, let's just do these down here all right so I don't know this let's see all right I think I got this, alright, let's see, and as you guys can see, we got the in numerical order from ace to king. Alright guys, hope you like the trick, and stick around for the tutorial. Hey guys, hope you like the trick, and uh, yeah, so now uh, I'm going to show you guys the, uh, the, the tutorial. So, here's the thing. Um, in order to do this trick, you need to have the cards in a certain order, and you want to have them, not like this, you want to have them, you want to have it like this, my bad. So you want to have the queen, um, the jack, the two, the six, the ace, the five, the king, the ten, the nine, the four, the three, the seven, and the eight. That's the order that you want it. Um, uh, let me just, just like this. And um, you can, you guys can go and uh, pause the video, uh, get these down, I guess, write it down somewhere, I don't know. But um, you kind of just memorize it after performing this trick for a while. So, yeah. Now what you want to do is you want to just put this right... Oh, shoot. <laughs> My bad. You want to put this right on the bottom of the deck. Just like that. And now, so you have this in this random order. It's not very random, but we'll get into why that is later. Um, so you have this right here, and then you just have a shuffle deck right here. So now what you do is you just do a riffle shuffle. So you go up to a spectator and you say, alright, so um, why don't you say a suit? Um, now, they're probably not going to say it. There's, very, there's not a very small chance, but there's a small chance they'll say the suit that you got this order in. Um, but if they do, then, you know, I guess that's good. But you don't have to do that. You can just say, all right, so we're going to get all the hearts out of the deck or whatever suit you're using. So then you just do a riffle shuffle. doesn't matter how you do it, just a riffle shuffle. And now what you're going to do is you're going to turn it over and say, all right, let's get all the hearts or whatever suit you got out, out of the deck. And all you're doing, you want to make sure you get them out one at a time. Don't, just like this. See this? So you just, if they're, too, if there's ne if they're next to each other, don't put them down like this. Make sure you go one at a time. Because what you're wanting to do, what you're trying to do is you're trying to reverse the order of the cards. That's what you're trying to get at. So you're reversing the order of the cards. And now we've reached our last one. There's no more hearts in the deck. And now, um, when it was the queen first on the top and the jack and everything, now the eight is on top and the queen and the jack are on bottom. Now this is what you want to do. Here's the thing that you're going to have to memorize. Um, when, at first, this is, might be a little hard to memorize what you're supposed to do, but um, after a while, it gets easier. It gets easier and... Uh, you start remembering what you're supposed to do. So here's the first thing. You want to start off by kind of like as you're about to do an overhand riffle, sh not an overhand riffle shuffle. What am I saying? All right, sorry. Uh, um, an overhand shuffle. Um, so you're going to be holding it kind of like this, and uh, you're going to be peeling off two cards, and then just drop the rest on top. Now you want to peel off three cards, and drop the rest on top. Now you peel off four cards, 
and drop the rest on top. And now you're going to spread until you get three, drop it. Spread till you get two, drop it. Spread till you get three, drop it. Spread till you get two, drop it. Spread till you get three, drop it. Square it all up. And then here's the next part. You're going to out jog every other card. So you just lift that one up, spread one card, lift that one up, and you just keep doing this throughout the entire thing. And then you take all the out jogged ones out and place them on the top of the uh, packet. Now you're going to deal down first. Um, when I first started the trick, I would go like this first. It's important to deal down first. Remember that. So deal down the first. Take the next one and put it on the bottom. Deal, put to the bottom. Deal, put to the bottom. And you just do this until you're all out of cards. This is going to put it in numeric order. Don't ask me how. It just does. So <laughs> don't worry about it. You can experiment if you want. See why it does that. But I honestly just don't really care. It does it. And so, you know, whatever. And now, if done correctly, you should have King, Queen, Jack, and then it keeps going until you reach the Ace. So, that is Order from Chaos, or Rubik's Cards. Um, and, yeah, so go and press some people, and uh, that's going to be it uh, for today, guys. And uh, I actually forgot to say this in the video, but uh, I, s I commented this on the on the last video. I s um, so, if you guys don't know, I'm going to be posting Monday through Friday, and then uh, not on weekends. So... That's kind of what, I, what I'm planning on doing. And, uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Um, be sure to comment, like, subscribe, um, pretty much do whatever. Um, and, yeah, so that's going to be it for today, guys. Uh, thanks for watching.